a friend of mine designed this knife and wanted me to make it for him. And in exchange, he made me several cases of Mountain Dew beer. I hope you enjoy watching. An old saw blade is about the perfect material to make a kitchen knife out of. It's the perfect thickness. You don't have to forge at all. It's very hardenable material and it's super easy to cut out using a plasma cutter. So what we're doing here, we're just getting the knife up to critical temperature and we're going to let it cool slowly so as to anneal it so that we can work it, grind it, and get it ready to go. Now it's time to heat treat. What we want to do is try to heat the knife as evenly as possible. Try not to overheat it in one area or another. And once we get the knife up to critical temperature, it's time to quench. Now we're going to grind our bevels using this custom jig that I made. I usually only use the jig just to get my bevel started so I can get my bearings. Then after that I'll typically go freehand the rest of it. Now we move on to our sandpaper. We start at 80 grit and work our way finer and finer until we get the polish that we desire. This knife just would not cooperate, as you can see, just would not quench straight. So what happens when you try to straighten a hardened blade, even annealed it first and tried straightening it, no go. So I cut out a new one and I worked it hardened. Just cut out the saw blade and did not anneal it and I just take a pass on the grinder straight into the water pass on the grinder straight into the water took a lot longer those holes were interesting to drill good thing i had a uh, quarter inch carbide end mill otherwise no go again third time's the charm 